Hey everyone, it's me, El Reezy, and I am back from the grave to give you a reaction to Samurai Warriors 5 announcement trailer! And you would notice that this game is going to be focusing on the Oda clan this time around, not the Son of the clan! <laughs> because remember when Spirit of Sonata came out? In 2017? Okay. Now that you are caught up to what this is going on, well, let me explain a bit further. Summoner Warriors 5 is going to take the focus of not only Oda Nobunaga, the Demon King of the Sixth Heaven, but also his lackey and retainer, Akichi Mitsuhide. The very person who is famous, or so to say, infamous, for betraying Nobunaga. And that very particular traitor to uh, Nobunaga, Mitsuhide, was actually been slain at Yamazaki by uh, bandits. Because, let's just tell, um, let's go back into history, shall we? Okay. In 1582, after Honoji, Hideyoshi was actually trying to invade the Mori clan at this time. Even though Nobunaga ordered Hideyoshi to invade Chukoku and take the lands that the Mori had possessed for a few years and then take the Mori heartlands all by themselves. But, there was one bit of sad news for Hideyoshi's camp. And that was, Nobunaga died at Hanoji. The very person who expressed the news over to him was Kanbei Kuroda. And I'm actually hoping Kanbei and everybody else that wasn't in this announcement trailer makes a return at a certain form and I'm hoping we have more new characters coming but for the love of God Koi please cut Ishikawa Goemon in this game please please for the love of Muso greatness remove Goemon Ishikawa I swear Goemon is seriously lacking in Muso greatness. And also, I'm waiting for new characters, so spill the goods, Koi. Give me Miwa Nagahide. Give me Potato Samurai. I swear to God. Give me Potato Samurai, so I can just laugh my butt off. Seriously. I want to laugh my ass off to, uh, the game. So hard, like in Kessen 3, when people, were, well, like Toshi, I would say. No need to worry, Potato Samurai. <laughs> I mean, I swear to God, Koi, you need to add, like, a few new characters for the Yoda clan. Keep all the characters that were in from the fourth game, too. Like, how it was with Hisahide. Speaking of Hisahide, I will do is reveal screenshots in my next video for Samurai Warriors 5. Because this is a new playlist. I hear all by itself because all we got is summer 2021 uh, release date and right now we're waiting on more info from Koi Tecmo from Japan about with Samurai Warriors 5 and <laughs> I swear to God Koi is releasing this freaking video game this, this year, this summer, 
and I am so thrilled that they are doing this. Like, I mean it. Let's just be honest here. I really mean it. I was hyped from right after Dynasty Warriors 9 flopped in sales in the first few months of the game's release. This game is going to be bank right there for Koi Tecmo to redeem themselves from the failure that they had with Dynasty Warriors 9. When I played the game, right? I'll give you my opinion about Dynasty Warriors 9. It was... Pfft, it was like that for at least one to two years. And then when you get to 2020 with, with Dynasty Warriors 9, it went from... Pfft, to, yeah, yeah! It was really fun. All of a sudden. It got fun right then and there in 2020, all by itself, especially during the pandemic. The very pandemic that really shook the world to its core. The COVID-19 pandemic, in case anyone is wondering about with this. And this game is coming out this summer. And I am pumped, man. I can't believe it. I am so pumped for this game. Koei, you're redeeming yourself from the Dynasty Warriors 9 flop from 2018. I mean that in a lot sophisticated way of things of why I'm saying this to you guys right here. But, with all things seriously, I know that the story is going to be focusing on the Oda faction. Not the Sanada, not the Takeda, not even the freaking Mori or the other clans. They're just going to focus on the story with the Oda. And I'm hoping that they're bringing uh, retainers to no uh, for Nobunaga. And I'm hoping Nobutada gets added in this time around because I swear to God, if Nobutada doesn't get added, I will riot. Straight from the US to Japan, I swear, I will riot. A new age of battles begins. The latest entry in the Samurai Warriors franchise is coming to Nintendo Switch. Dive into the history of the Sengoku period as the series now shines the spotlight on Nobunaga Oda and Mitsuhide Akechi. Character designs and visuals have been revamped for this installment. Unleash high octane moves in electrifying 1 vs. 1000 battles. In Samurai Warriors 5, slashing its way onto Nintendo Switch, Summer 2021. <laughs> 